Yeah, KP, you know, uh, again, this is a positive summer for him. He's healthy, right? This isn't a time where he's coming off an injury. Um, I think he's really excited about this opportunity. I think he's a perfect fit for Luca. Um, again, he has a skill set that a lot of people don't have in our league. And so for as a coach, I'm very excited to be able to work with him. Second question, I said it earlier, I think we're excited about KP being healthy. I think he's excited, he's ready to work, um, and I think you're going to see a different KP. Yeah, and honestly, I don't think I can add much more than what Jason said. I think he said it perfectly. Yeah, I, I would like to add something on KP. I think he's been unfairly maligned. You know, during the playoffs, he did exactly what he was asked to do, exactly. He put team first, and he put his own personal statistics knowing that people were going to give him a hard time because, as he said to me and others, he just wants to win. And to Jay Kidd's point and Nico's point, this is going to be the first season with the Dallas Mavericks where he's coming in healthy. And he's able to work on things other than just rehabbing to get his body ready, to, to get stronger, to work on his game, something he has not been able to do. And, you know, I, I think... You know, I even hear from my own son, and, I, and I've got to sit him down and say, you don't understand, right? You know, to Jay Kidd's point, he's, you know, you can't teach seven foot four, and you can't teach shooting, you can't teach his ability to create shots, but now he's going to have a chance to have some continuity, and that's something he has not had since he's effectively been a rookie. And so I think, you know, with what Jay Kidd and Nico have planned, um, the ability for, for um, KP to work, you know, I think him and Luca are going to be a lot better together. And as, as a team, to, to Nico's point, I think you're going to see a lot of things that are going to make us far better as a team.